Yeah, so now the other thing I want to talk about is, uh, let's say your power goes out and the battery runs out before it comes back on and all your machines gracefully shut down, but then an hour later the power comes back on, right? And let's say you're not home. Well, you can actually have your machines come back on without you being there. So now the oh. way this works is uh, you would take a, one of those single board PCs like a Raspberry Pi or a late potato that, mm-hmm. that we recommended. And the way these work is once, once they get power, they turn on. They don't care, right? You don't need a button. They just always turn on. Okay. So you can have these things uh, do a periodic, uh, it's called a wake on LAN packet. And what this is, 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 is it pings out on your network and says, hey, wake up. And if your computer uh, is powered on and it receives this packet, it will now boot up. Okay. So you don't have to have someone there pressing the button. Okay. So what I've done is uh, I, I made a little script that pings all my important devices every five minutes and says, hey, turn on. Now, if they're already on, they just ignore it, right? Yeah. But if the power's out, then they'll turn on. Oh, okay. Now, the one annoying thing is if you manually turn the machine off, five minutes later, it's going to turn itself back on, right? <laughs> so you have to make sure you turn off their script when you're trying to turn your machine off. But other than that, uh, yeah, you can have your, your network gracefully shut down in a power outage and then come back up when the power's back on all without you being there. Uh, and, and make sure you have, you turn this on in the BIOS because the wake on land feature is usually turned off by default. Yeah. So you got to turn your go into your BIOS settings and, and turn it on. Uh, now let's talk about uh, which devices I recommend. 